Good morning, everybody. How's everybody doing today? Today is Wednesday, January the 8th, and this is today's daily devotion. Softly, I announce my presence. Shimmering hues of shimmering hues of radiance tap gently at your consciousness, seeking entrance. Though I have all power in heaven and on earth, I am I I am <clears throat> infinitely tender with you. The weaker you are, the more gently I approach you. Let your weakness be a door to my presence. Whenever you feel whenever you feel inadequate, remember that I am your ever present help. Hope in me, and you will be protected from from <clears throat> depression and self pity. Hope is like a golden cord connecting you to heaven. The more you cling to this cord, the more I bear the weight of your burdens. You cling you cling to this cord, the more, I, the more I bear the weight of your burdens. Thus you are lighted, lightened. Heaviness is not of my kingdom. Cling to hope, and my rays of light will, will reach you through the darkness. And there are three verses. First is Psalm 46.1. God is our refuge and strength, and ever-present help, ever help in trouble. Next is Romans 12.12. 12. Be joyful in hope, patient in affliction, faithful in prayer. And next is Romans fifteen thirteen. May the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust in him, so that you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen and amen. Now we read the Word of God, which we are in Proverbs chapter 8. And the title is, The Blessing of Wisdom. And this is what the Word of God says. Does not wisdom call? Does not understanding raise her voice? On the, heights, on the heights beside the way, at the crossroads, she takes her stand. Beside the gates in the front of the town, at the entrance of the porters, portals, she cries aloud. To you, O man, I call. And my cry is to the children of man. O simple ones, learn prudence. O fools, learn sense. Hear, for I will speak noble things. And from my lips will come what is right. For my mouth will utter truth. Wickedness is, is, in, is in abomination to my lips. All the words of my mouth are righteous. There is, none, there is nothing twisted or crooked in them. Could end them. They are all straight. They are all straight to him who understands, in the right of those who find knowledge. Take my instruction instead of silver, knowledge rather than gold, rather than cho cho choice gold. For wisdom is better than jewels, and all that you may desire cannot compare with her. I wisdom dwell with prudence, and I find knowledge and and discretion. The fear of the Lord is hatred of evil, pride and, pride and arrogance in the way of evil, and perverted speech I hate. I have counsel in sound wisdom. I have insight. I have strength. By me, kings reign and rules decree what is just. By me, princes rule and nobles all who have governed justly. I love those who love me and seek and those who seek me diligently find me. Riches and honor are with me, enduring wealth and righteousness. My fruit is better than gold, even fine gold, and my yield than choice silver. I walk in the way of righteous, in the paths of justice, granting granting an inheritance to those who to those who love me, and filling their treasures. The Lord possessed me at the beginning of his work. The first of the first of his acts of old. Ages ago I was set up. At the first before the beginning of the earth. When there was when there were no depths, I was brought forth. Where when there were no springs abounding with water. Before the mountains I had been sharp shaped. Before the hills I was brought forth. Before he had made the earth with its field. Or the first of the dust of the world. When he established 
the heavens, I was there. When he drew a circle on the face of the deep, when he made the firm of the skies above, when he established the fountains of the deep, when he assigned to the sea its limits, so that the water may not transgress his command, when he marked out the foundations of the earth, then I was beside him, like a master workman, and I was daily his delight, rejoicing before him always, rejoicing in his rejoicing in, in his inhabited inhabited world, and delighting in the children of man. And now, O sons, listen to me. Blessed are those who keep my ways, hear instruction and be wise, and do not and do not neglect it. Blessed is the one who listens to me, watching daily at my gates, waiting beside my doors. For for whoever finds me finds life, and obtains favor from the Lord. But but he who fails to find me injures himself. All who hate me love death. Wow. So guys, I'm just going to sum that very quickly. The blessing of wisdom is that it is important in life. I highly encourage you to find wisdom today and the rest of your life. That is my message for you guys today. Find wisdom today and cling to it all the days of your life. Guys, if you like this video, hit the do, smash that like button. Hit the wonderful subscribe button down, down as well. And also hit the notification bell twice to get notified of all that I post. Guys, have a great day. God bless. And remember, you are loved by God. Have a great day, everybody. God bless you all.